मंजिरी वड़संकर डायरेक्टर भिड़े हॉस्पिटल टेस्ट यू बेबी सेंटर नवी पेट पुणे टुडे आई गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट थायरॉइड डिसऑर्डर्स एंड इनफर्टिलिटी Now, whenever we know that a patient cannot naturally conceive, she consults us. That doctor, what is the exact problem? Would you uh, investigate me and let me know? And in a pursuit to understand the cause of her infertility, we do a lot of blood investigations, sonography of the husband as well as the wife. Now, we we've got to know that around thirty to forty percent of the couples who suffer from infertility have a coincidental diagnosis of thyroid disorders it can be hypothyroidism or hyperthyroidism now how is this thyroid related to infertility thyroid hormone is a hormone which is secreted by the thyroid gland which is present in the neck of males as well as the females and this is the actual gland which regulates the balance between the brain function that is the hypothalamus and the pituitary and it connects it functionally to the ovary so in short it is a hormone which is extremely important for egg development egg maturation and egg rupture during fertility so whenever there is a problem with this hormone these sequence sequentially do not happen and hence as a result of which many patients come to us saying that we do not have a rupture of our egg or egg is not getting formed at all on a sonography which is done to track the follicles which is follicular monitoring now why is this thyroid hormone going into imbalance in around 30% of the patients so let us see that we seen and analyzed and there are various studies which have attributed the connection of the thyroid hormone to the weight of the male as well as the female and hence extremely overweight or underweight patients or if a patient has gained weight during the process is prone to have thyroid disorder apart from these patients who are having a sedentary lifestyle with lack of exercise apart from these patients present themselves as irregular periods or complete stoppage of periods or the flow becomes extremely thin that is she hardly bleeds for half a day instead of her four days cycle while on the other hand very thin hypothyroid patient may bleed like a tap for 5 to 7 days some patients present with irregular menstrual cycles and hot flushes so the patient sweats a lot or certain patients feel extremely cold so these hormonal disorders can be because of a thyroid dysfunction and the only idea is to investigate that how wrong is the thyroid so we do a test which is known as t3 t4 tsh which are thyroid hormone levels which help us to identify the level of the thyroid disorder and supplementation of a thyroid medicine is the only answer for that once we supplement the medicine we have seen miraculous improvement in the egg development as well as rupture and many patients have landed up even with a natural pregnancy while in our ivf cases we have seen improvements in the egg quality the sperm functions as well as improved fertilization and implantation in ivf patients as well so if you are a thyroid patient no need to worry just get yourself evaluated and treated well before you start your fertility management thank you